So recently I gave an interview and in that interview I was asked this question, what will be the output of this? So we have a strict equality operator in between. On the left hand side we have 0 0.1 plus 0 0.2 and on the right hand side we have 0 0.3. Okay, so I hope you're ready with your answer. If you answered false, then you are 100% correct. Now let us understand this why, okay. We'll start by removing this section, okay. And now if we log this, okay, 0 0.1 plus 0 0.2. If we log this, we can see the answer is 0 0.3 which are with, with a bunch of zeros, but it has a four at the end. And here's where the problem lies. 0 0.2 plus 0 0.1 or the other way around doesn't make a difference. The What makes a difference is that it does not add up to 0 0.3 and hence we get that answer as a false, okay. Uh, now, why does this happen, okay? So apparently uh, JavaScript stores these numbers in the IEEE 754 binary floating point standard. Okay, now cause of that, right? Uh, we don't get the answers that we would normally expect like we saw in this scenario, okay? And hence that is the reason why the comparison fails. It is not the fault of the programmer, it is, fault. It is JavaScript's issue, okay? But uh, now the real question is like, uh, the interviewer will ask you like what to do, right? If you have this scenario, you're dealing with floating point numbers, okay? So when you're dealing with floating point numbers, okay? Uh, Remember, always scale those numbers as in multiply to make them whole numbers like, you know, multiply them by 10 or 100, basically convert them to their integer counterparts, okay, and then divide them back, okay. So this helps us avoid all these, you know, precision bugs that would result in such surprising scenarios. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more.